Hi, I'm Jean, and I'm the troop leader for Daisy Troop 54321. I was a Girl Scout when I was younger, and when my daughter decided she wanted to be a Girl Scout, I jumped at the chance to be a troop leader. I am very excited for all the amazing things we will get to do this year. This is Emma. She will be the assistant leader. Hi everyone. This is my first experience with Girl Scouts. When my daughter told me she wanted to join, I didn't know what to expect, but I'm here to learn with you all and I'm very excited to see what we can do this year. Thank you for everyone who filled out the meeting survey we sent out in the welcome email. Based on the results, we decided that our troop will meet twice a month on Wednesdays from 5 to 6, right here at the community center. This is the date and time that seemed to work best for everyone. If there are any concerns, please let me know after the meeting. Let's take a minute to go around and introduce ourselves and let us know what you or your girls' expectations are for Girl Scouts this year. And that is the Girl Scout Promise and Law. As Daisies, we will be working on earning petals that teach the girls all about each part by doing hands-on and collaborative activities each meeting. To keep our troop girl led, we'll also introduce other Daisy badges and the Daisy journeys based on the girls' interests. We will let you know what those are once we start meeting with the girls and have them vote on it. Besides badge and journey work at our troop meetings, we are also planning to have a few small outings and field trips based on the pedals and badges they earn and the take action projects they wish to complete. We will let you know all about them as soon as we finalize the details. You can take home the What Daisies Do resource and show your girls so that they can begin thinking about what they would like to accomplish in Girl Scouting this year. Let's go over some of the Daisy badge topics now. Although we don't have it all planned out yet, we want to be sure to keep you all in the loop. As we learn more about the girls and their interests, we will update our troop calendar with badges we will be working on. Based on the survey you filled out, most people prefer to be updated via email, and that works best for us too. So be sure to check your emails for troop meeting and activity updates. Family is an important part of Girl Scouts, and we want you to be involved too. We've provided you with a few resources about how you can help your Girl Scout at home and be more involved. We'll also provide you with a link to the Family Connection Guide that you can use to connect with your girl. We are also planning to host a Court of Awards in the middle and end of the Girl Scout year to present the girls with all the pedals and badges they have earned, and we welcome families to come and help the troop celebrate the girls' accomplishments. While we hope you and your girls enjoy beginning Girl Scouts at home, we would also like to give you the opportunity to help the whole troop too. We will be needing a few adult volunteers to help us at troop meetings and to drive and chaperone girls on outings. But first, we're going to need a troop treasurer and product program manager. Let's go over the roles we need now. Now that you know the troop roles we will need for this year, please be sure to put your name on the volunteer sign-up sheet next to the role you are interested in before you leave tonight. If you're not sure yet, please fill out the adult interest survey in your packet. There is a job for everyone. So you may be thinking, how will we afford to do all these fun things? Well, as discussed in the welcome email, we are requesting an initial startup contribution from each family to help us get started with supplies for meeting activities. I will collect the dues for each girl at the end of the meeting. If you don't have it tonight, please bring it to the next troop meeting. We are also requesting each girl buy their own uniform and identification badges and pins. If you need financial assistance, please contact me after the meeting. To pay for outings, take action projects, and supplies later in the year, we are planning to participate in both the Fall Take Action product program coming up and the cookie program in spring. We'll have another parent meeting as those dates get closer to give you all the details. Depending on how much the troop earns, we are hoping to be able to pay for next year's troop registration for every girl who wants to renew and summer camp. Besides earning money, the product program will teach girls five critical skills. I am so excited to work with the girls on all these fun Girl Scout activities. At this time, we will answer any questions you have. Thank you so much for coming and letting us tell you all about our troop year. The girls will be joining us again soon, and we can do our friendship circle and the meet new friend song they just learned. As we wait, please take time to fill out the Girl Health History form and annual permission form. After we are done, make sure you gather your personal items your troop packet, turn in your forms and dues, and fill out the volunteer sign-up sheet on your way out. And remember, you can email us if you have any questions, and be on the lookout for troop updates. 